SMIC, China's largest chipmaker, faced a challenging 2024. Despite an increase in revenue, reaching 8 billion US dollars, the company's profits plummeted by 45.4% year-on-year to 492.7 million US dollars. This stark contrast between revenue growth and profit decline raises concerns about SMIC's underlying health and its ability to compete on the global stage. The fourth quarter of 2024 painted a particularly bleak picture. Profits nosedived by 38.4% year-on-year to 107.6 million US dollars, falling short of analyst expectations. This decline was primarily attributed to reduced investment income and financial income, highlighting the company's vulnerability to external economic factors. Despite these challenges, SMIC's revenue continued to grow, reaching 2.2 billion US dollars in the fourth quarter of 2024, a 31.5% increase year on year. This growth was driven by strong demand for mature node chips, which are used in a wide range of consumer electronics and home appliances. However, the profit plunge indicates that SMIC is struggling to translate its revenue growth into profitability. This raises serious questions about the company's long-term sustainability and its ability to compete with industry giants like Taiwan's TSMC. The company's heavy investment in expanding production capacity, while necessary for future growth, further strains its financial performance in the short term. The escalating trade tensions between the United States and China have cast a long shadow over SMIC's future. Washington's restrictions on exporting advanced semiconductor technology and equipment to China have severely hampered SMIC's ability to develop cutting-edge chips. These restrictions have forced SMIC to rely on older, less efficient technology, putting it at a significant disadvantage compared to its international rivals. This technological gap is particularly evident in the production of advanced chips used in artificial intelligence applications, a rapidly growing and highly lucrative market. Despite the US restrictions, SMIC has continued to invest heavily in research and development, pouring billions of dollars into catching up with its global competitors. However, the company faces an uphill battle in bridging the technological gap, especially as the US tightens its grip on semiconductor technology exports. The return of Donald Trump to the White House in 2025 has further exacerbated trade tensions between the two superpowers. Trump's aggressive stance on China, particularly in the realm of technology, suggests that SMIC can expect even greater challenges in the years to come. The contrasting fortunes of SMIC and TSMC, the world's largest contract chipmaker, underscore the impact of US trade restrictions on China's semiconductor industry. While SMIC grappled with shrinking profits in 2024, TSMC reported a 57% year-on-year surge in net profit in the fourth quarter of the same year. This stark difference in performance highlights the technological gap that separates SMIC from its Taiwanese rival. Despite significant investments from the Chinese government, SMIC's technical capabilities lag behind TSMC which continues to dominate the market for advanced chips used in smartphones, data centers, and other high-end applications. TSMC's dominance in the semiconductor industry is a testament to its technological prowess and its ability to adapt to changing market demands. The company's strong financial performance allows it to invest heavily in research and development, further solidifying its technological lead. In contrast, SMIC's reliance on older technology limits its ability to compete in the most profitable segments of the market. The company's focus on mature node chips, while generating revenue, is unlikely to close the gap with TSMC or other leading chip makers. Despite the challenges posed by US trade restrictions, China remains determined to become a global leader in the semiconductor industry. Beijing views self-sufficiency in chipmaking as a national priority, essential for maintaining its economic growth and technological competitiveness. To achieve this goal, China has poured billions of dollars into its domestic semiconductor industry, supporting companies like SMIC and fostering the development of homegrown technology. However, building a world-class semiconductor industry is a complex and time-consuming endeavor, requiring substantial financial resources, technological expertise, and a skilled workforce. While China has made some progress in developing its domestic chip-making capabilities, it still heavily relies on foreign technology and equipment. The U.S. restrictions have exposed vulnerabilities in China's supply chain, 
highlighting the country's dependence on foreign companies for critical components and technology. Overcoming these challenges will require a sustained and coordinated effort from the Chinese government and industry leaders. China needs to attract top talent, foster innovation, and create a favorable environment for the growth of its semiconductor sector. The road ahead for China's semiconductor ambitions is long and arduous. While the country has made significant strides, it still faces formidable obstacles, including U.S. trade restrictions, technological gaps, and a shortage of skilled workers. Only time will tell if China can overcome these hurdles and achieve its goal of becoming a global leader in the semiconductor industry.